Jane, a goalless draw here in St Petersburg. You and the rest of the, the coaching staff must be absolutely chuffed to bits with that. Yeah, so early in the competition, it was important that we came out here and um, the least that, that we got was a point and thankfully we had that. I think the girls um, committed to the plan, worked extremely hard and defended extremely well. And, you know, in the last couple of minutes there, we could have nicked it. Penalty. Um, I was hoping it was going to be given. Unfortunately, we didn't get it. But, you know, we're, we're happy with the point. Three points would have been even better, but a point is what we came for. So, happy going home. It certainly was backs against the walls, particularly in that, that second half, four long periods. But you must be thrilled with the way that the girls stuck to the game plan. Yeah, look, they, they understand this is a long competition. It's important to come to these places and get something. You know, um, Russia are the second ranked team in this group. We're the third. We come out here as underdogs and to get something out of the game is fantastic. In the previous campaign, we travelled to these stronger teams and we, we got beaten fairly convincingly. So for us, we see the, the, the growth of the team, we see growth of individuals and the collective and it's, it's a massive positive for us. I know it's a team game and it's a squad game, but you don't, probably don't want to highlight individuals, but I thought Sophie Ingle was led by example. Look, I, 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 I could pick them all out. I'm so pleased they were all given their jobs to do and they did their jobs. You know, we, we came into this with a slightly different way of playing, slightly different thought process and they've stuck to the plan and they've worked extremely hard for each other. Um, times you know people were throwing heads where other people were throwing feet so they're committed to this and they want to achieve during that campaign and I'm so pleased for them to come and travel all this way work so hard this week and, and get what they wanted from the game and two clean sheets from the first two games as well must be pleasing yeah look you know we're, as, as I've said earlier we're, we're a developing team we're still a young team with regards to these players playing together as a, as a starting lineup and the development they are, they are going through right now is happening really quickly. From our backline perspective and our goalkeeper, they're performing, they're, they're massive. Their performances are massive for us. And, you know, when they're playing well, we know we've got a chance of getting even more of the game in the future. Just finally, the win over Kazakhstan, this goalless draw here tonight, sets it up nicely, doesn't it, for the, for the next home game, which is the first first game in Wales with this campaign? Yeah, look, we, we've already spoken about that at the end of the game. We're, we're pleased with tonight, but we know we have a, a big job to do in the next four weeks. You know, two big games for us that, that can hopefully set us up for the for next year and finishing off this campaign. We're, we're hungry and uh, the girls' performance showed that tonight. We were never going to give in. You know, we, we've uh, defended better than I've ever seen us defend tonight and, you know, creating chances at the end there as well.